Police search for a shooter tonight after a Little Rock woman is shot in the head while walking into her home on Halloween night. Good evening. Glad you're with us for Fox 16 News at 530. I'm Donna Terrell. I'm Kevin Kelly. Let's get to the details. It happened on Fulton Street and police say a five-year-old child witnessed the shooting from a parked car. Fox 16's Price McKeon joining us live in the studio with the latest on this investigation. Price. At this point, homie, detectives are still trying to determine if this was a random shooting or if someone or some place was targeted. That has many neighbors not wanting to talk, and the few who did talk, did talk with fear. They have this special thing where, you know, you can get it like the next day. Vicki Evans likes to shop online. I just love to shop on the internet. And says that's what she was doing Halloween night. Until they said it was like pow, 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 like that. She got a call from her neighbor. She was saying, is everything all right? So I just heard the pow, pow, pow. This grandma lives a street over from where Little Rock police say a 27-year-old woman was shot in the head while walking into her home around 1020. Oh, I am appalled for the simple reason. I'm not saying that this would not happen anywhere else. Okay, crime is everywhere. It hits everybody. But I'm just appalled at the idea that somebody feels that comfortable to come in a neighborhood and do like that. Police say outside the Fulton Street home, a five-year-old child sat in a parked car. Can you imagine the trauma that that child will experience the rest of his, of his life? I know I heard two different guns. This neighbor didn't want to show her face, fearing for her safety. Because when the first set went off, the next set came. And that's when you just heard like boom, 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 boom. That is traumatic on any child. You know, uh, me, I've never seen that myself. So I, um, that's terrible. This grandma says what happened in her neighborhood will impact people with any love in their hearts. Police told us officers found what they believe to be marijuana in a truck that bullets also hit. LRPD says the five-year-old child thankfully was not injured, but as for that 27-year-old woman, she's still listed in critical condition. Detectives have not released any suspect information. Back to you.